Okay, so, so there are different classifications of water erosion. And, and they, I have them on the board here from uh, least destructive to, to most damaging. Um, sheet, rill, and gully erosion. Uh, sheet erosion is just what it sounds like. It's just the water is flowing over the surface of the land um, as sort of a flat sheet. Um, then over time, if you have this, have a lot of this, you end up with real erosion. And because what happens, uh, some of the various places in the surface of the soil are more erodible than others. And so you start to get these little channels cut in them. And then over time, those small, and that's real erosion. And then over time, um, those small channels become really deep channels, and this is gully, gully erosion. Uh, just a, another quick observation from when I was in, in West Tennessee, that a lot of the times there would be, the farms would be, the land would be higher than the road, and I'm not sure why that was, but in many cases, as you were driving down the road, the fields would be a bit higher uh, than you were, than where you were, and it was very much so a farming area. And I remember one time I was at, and they would get huge rains. They'd have amazing storms, uh, tornadoes. It was not not my favorite place to live uh, for a variety of reasons, including 110 degrees in summer in August uh, for a couple of weeks. Uh, but anyway, I remember one time I was at um, the store grocery store and while I was in the grocery store there was a thunderstorm and when I went out there was literally like eight inches of standing water on the parking lot because it's it's pretty flat there so there's no place for the water to go and I remember pushing my cart out to the car it was like I was a boat you know <laughs> so I was pushing my cart my bottom of my pants and my shoes were completely soaked I uh, put my stuff in the car and, and as I was driving home the water was blasting off of these fields onto the road, um, um, and and that was be you know like a perfect example of either sheet erosion or this real erosion. Now in places out there, you had these deep gullies cut where this had gone on, on uh, no one had addressed the problem, and so you had these really deep gullies because, as I said, they had such thick easily eroded topsoil that uh, this was a major problem out there. But again, they had a lot of soil, so um, it wasn't as big a problem as it could be.